Well, good morning my crafty friends. I hope you're well. This is the first video I've done in over a week because I've been poorly and today I'm going to be doing my mini mission for October which is S for shelter and the prompt reads protection and security a place to hide and be safe from the world a cosy house home or structure excuse me A refuge, den or nest. <coughs> As you can see, I've still not got rid of this cough. So, I'm going to turn you to overhead. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh my gosh. Oh, tickle him in the <coughs> throat. Very sorry about that. As I said, I'm going to turn you to overhead. And let's make a start okay so I'm going to be using my pink pig um, landscape journal today I've give the page a color wash of um, gesso and I've used art basics by Finny bar in white I'm going to be using paper artsies fresco finish chalk acrylic paints in Bora Bora and uh, blue oyster which are like a blue and green so I'm going to be using that I'm going to be using these this house stencil from Mike Deacon Art and this um, ivy stencil from Imagination Crafts and uh, so first thing I want to do is I want to add I'm just going to add uh, some of the blue and using a baby wipe, I'm just going to work it in and then the green as well. That's that done. Put them to one side and I'll give this a quick blast with the heat gun. Next thing I want to do is I'm going to use some burnt umber and this is a Do Crafts acrylic paint and I'm going to um, use a blending tool to um, put my houses in. I'm just going to do a row of houses across here and that is going to be um, I suppose we could say our homes are our shelters shelters from the cold and that one and I want a couple of little ones here just going to put a couple of little ones on the bottom here and I'm just using my blending tool and I'm kind of stippling with them with it so I'll get some texture going to add some splats sh shortly so I'm going to give that a quick blast with the heat gun 
next thing I want to do I've got this stamp from Inkylicious and it says home is where love resides memories are recreated friends all are always welcome and laughter never ends and I want to stamp that there I think so I'm going to be using my archival black ink pad up and give it quite a bit of pressure especially with it being going over gesso and that I like to give it a good press down always keeping one hand on my acrylic block as I move my other hand around there oh good I'm happy with that and next I want to do some um, I've got some I've got archival leaf green and I'm just going to add some uh, ivy coming down uh, do like Ivy. When we moved in here the front of the house was covered in it but got rid of it because it was eaten away at the oh, I can't remember what it's called now. between the the brick so we had to get the house then repointed when I got rid of it all so, when I think back to when we first moved it in here 20 odd years ago and the changes we've done it's amazing <laughs> So the ivy is sheltering the houses, the houses shelter, your home shelters you. So I think I've got it covered with shelter for this one, I think. Um, so they need washing, well, I don't know where it is. Um, so what I want to do next is I just want to do some, uh, just a little board around I'm just going to do some crosses I think just down one side two sides Then I'm going to think I'm going to call this mini mission complete. So a few down here.
There we go. So all that's left for me to do is assign it. Um, like to say thank you so much for watching today I hope you've enjoyed I know I have and um, please like subscribe and uh, leave a comment and until next time happy crafting bye bye for now